Hey guys, I'm back with another work um, opportunity for you guys. So in this video, we'll be going through how you can go about applying for the H2B program where you guys can either go over state to work in Canada, US, or if you want to work locally um, with a local company or someone to help you. So you're going to go to your Google, go to Ministry of Labor and Security. Let me just type that out. So Ministry of Labor and Security. So you're going to go to their official website, guys. Please ensure that you're going to their website. One way to know if it's official, you can look at the URL. It's going to say um, gov.jm. So you'll know it's the official website and they're located in North Street. So you're going to click on Employment Agencies Unit. That's where we want to click. So let me tap on it. It takes a, little, a bit of time to load. I'm not sure why. But their website takes a bit of time to load. It's currently loading. So this is where you'll be able to navigate through. And you can read up on the program as well. Read up on what is H2B. If you want to work overseas for like six months up to a year, then this is what you'd go on. So you can get work permit. This section is not for you. This is if you want to operate and monitor a private employment agency. So this doesn't work for you. Let me just get that off the screen. So let me just scroll down. So this part doesn't go for you, as I mentioned. So this is a section that we want to look at. The links below list, uh, display, sorry, the approved employment agency both locally and overseas. So let's click on the local one first. So you have some agencies like Abcor Employment Agency, and they're located in Spanish Town. And you can contact Miss Rodriguez, and the phone number is there as well. Um, there's also HR Solutions. Caribbean HR Solutions, and they are located in Winchester Cent um, Winchester Centers, um, St. James. So, so there are quite a few of them, 13 I'm seeing on the list here that's approved. And this list was updated in February of 2022, which is this year, and is subjected to change monthly, so you can check this as well. So these are some of the local job agencies that you can reach out to and try to have them help you find something locally. Again, um, as mentioned, this is coming directly from the Ministry of Labor website. I don't know these persons. I'm not working for them, nor am I, yeah, no affiliation with them. I'm just trying to give you guys some insightful information. So let's go back to the one that everybody really, really wants to do, which is the one overseas, right? Which is the overseas employment. Now, for that one specifically, let me go back. As I mentioned before, the site kind of take long. So bear with me. Now, for that one, you just click on number two where it says approved agency for overseas. There are quite a few of them here that you can contact their name, number, and address is on the file. You can go ahead and contact them. And I, and I know a lot of them, they do have an Instagram page or a Facebook page that you can go and call them. Some of them, I've heard about Access to Success Employment Agency number three. They're very popular as well. They're located in 51 Slip Road. Kingston 5. You can contact the person that is on the list. I'll put the link for this in the description so you guys can go ahead and check it out. Just click on the direct link for it to take you to this PDF form so you can call them. Buy some credit. Put on the phone, man. Buy some credit and call them because who doesn't want to work? And you know, I'm going to feed you guys in on any little job opportunity I hear about. I know it's a season when they're taking persons to go overseas. February, because the one person is for the summer which is April straight to October, September. And they also one persons for December, which is the winter season. So this is a great opportunity for you guys to call them, find out how it works, how, what's the process like, the application process as well. Call them and find out. And they also do J1 placement. That's for students, college students, or the seasonal hotel programs. And this is mostly for skilled workers. Right. This is most for skilled workers. If you have any certificate from heart in hotel or cook or you name it. But even if you don't have that, I say give it a shot because you might never know. They may have something for you um, based on your work experience. Thank you guys for watching.